Hello, I'm Sasha from 233, the pink team, and this is our deep climb. How it works is, this is the main deep climb. It is firstly tucked in like this, and it is kept with zip ties, zip tied to the winch, which is right here. When the winch is activated, it spins and the zip tie break, and it deploys like this, and, it, and the bottom part of the climber gets caught on this little metal bracket here, which, which goes on the bottom of the deep cage. This, would, this stays like this, and it is tensioned with the rope, which is not on right now, but it would be tensioned like this with the rope. It would drive into the deep cage, and these would these are deployed with rubber bands and would go into here. These would snap out like this, and the climber would the climber would winch in the winch with the rope, and it and the deep climb the deep cage would be inside a robot, which is a successful climb. So we have a servo mechanism which spins, which th these these spin, and the bungee, which is over here, and a rope, which is over here, help pull the funnel out of the way to the side of the robot outside the frame perimeter right here so the deep cage can fully go into the robot and have a legal climb. First, teams benefit when they optimize their robots utilizing Altair tools. Earn up to $5,000 for your team when you enter the Altair Global Student Contest through June 30th, 2025. Go to altair.com contest for further details.